Hi students, in this video I want to show you how you can embed images into the discussion boards here on Blackboard and I'll start by going to a discussion board. Oops, helps if you click on discussion board. So in this discussion board I'm being asked to find examples of different kinds of typography and one kind of typography is art typography. So I'm going to create a thread and following the instructions I'm going to call it art typography and then I have this little WYSIWYG editor. What you see is what you get is what WYSIWYG stands for where I can type my response. But in this case I'm being asked to provide a photo. So I'm going to find a photo that represents art typography and then I'm going to stick it into my response. So let me pull up an example of art typography that I found. This is an example that I see a lot. It's very obviously an artistic use of typography. I want to click on view original image and then I want to click and drag that image to my desktop. There it is. And then go back into Blackboard and I want to click the little picture icon where it says insert edit image. So I'm going to click on that. I'm going to select that picture from my desktop. And I'm going to insert it. And it's going to warn me that I don't have an image description and that's okay. So now that image is in my post. If I click submit, when other people open my post, they'll just see that picture right in there. Now another thing that you can do to insert an, Im to insert an image is to click on the little image insert button. And then here where it, I'm being asked for the image URL, I can go back to that picture copy the URL. Now the image has to be the only thing here on this page. If there's other stuff on this page like a logo or some text, this is not going to work. You need to click the picture all the way through so the picture is the only thing on the page and then you're going to copy that URL. Oops, I lost my insert. There we go. Click insert. You can see it drops the picture in there. And that picture is now in my editor. I'm not seeing it because of uh, Blackboard. Let's hit submit and I'll show you what happens. So when I click on it, you know, when I added it, you couldn't see it, but I have now gone through and opened it and it's actually there. I actually think it's better to pull the picture onto your desktop because then you know the picture is going to be there. What's happening when you give Blackboard the URL is every time someone opens your thread, Blackboard goes to the URL, grabs the picture, and then drops it in to show someone. And that means that if the person you got the picture from, you know, the website you got it from, if they move it or lose the picture or change, you know, something happens, the site goes down, when people come to your thread, there's not going to be anything there. So I think it's actually better to just grab the picture, put it on your desktop, and then upload it to Blackboard. Once you've got it uploaded, you can drag it to the trash from your desktop. You don't need it anymore.